Jose Mourinho was involved in a furious tunnel bust-up with Manchester City rival Edison after the derby ended in chaos. The Manchester United boss had milk and water thrown on him in the wake of City's crushing 21 at Old Trafford. Mourinho took exception to the manner in which Pep Guardiola's men were celebrating the win. He walked to the City dressing room to ask the players to show more respect as bled from the visiting changing room. But a war of words ended up breaking out with Mourinho and Edison believed to have been yelling at each other in Portuguese as a melee took place. Getty woe through the milk over Jose Mourinho. Getty Fernandinho is the bookie's favourite to have thrown the milled identity is unknown but Paddy Power have priced up the identity of the mystery milkman. They make midfield destroyer Fernandinho favourite 51 to have created a milkshake. Other contenders include Sergio Augero at 81 and City boss Pep Guardiola at 161. Romelu Lukaku 251 is among the candidates while United outcast Luke Shaw is rated at 251. But the bookies have also priced up whether Mourinho threw the milk at himself 1001 in what would be diversion tactics at the very best. Spokesman Paddy Power said, Would you be surprised if it turned out that Jose had thrown milk over himself? From drama queen to dairy queen, though I also think that Romelu Lukaku is decent value, but he was probably aiming at Pep, of course, 51 Fernandino 61 Nicolas Otamendi 81 Kyle Walker 81 Sergio Aguero 81 Raheem Sterling 101 Kevin De Bruyne 121 Vincent Company 161 Pep Guardiola 201 Romelu Lukaku 201 Edson 251 Noel Gallagher 251 Luke Shaw 1001 Jose Mourinho 1001 Michael Oliver 1001 Sir Alex Ferguson 1001 Sir Bobby Charlton Monday December 11, 2017 Mourinho walked away but went on to accuse City of being protected by luck after claiming his team were denied a clear penalty against the to rivals for the second successive season at Old Trafford. He said Manchester City are a very good team and they're protected by the luck, and the gods of football are behind them. My first reaction is I feel sorry for referee Michael Oliver because he had a very good match but unfortunately he made an important mistake. It is like last season, exactly the same. You can speak about anything you want, you can bring any football theory, you can bring the stats, the ball possession, you can bring everything you want but, like last season, it is a huge penalty in a crucial moment of the game.